Welcome to Audio Media Channel. This is Selva Kumar. Today we are going to look at something called a shutter angle. Do you know what a shutter angle is? Shutter angle is a representation of shutter speed. Shutter speed is a term that you use in DSLRs. But shutter angle is a term that is used to represent the same thing in a movie camera. A 180 degree shutter angle is equivalent to 1 by 48 of a second when we are shooting in 24 frames. This gives an optimal motion blur. What is a motion blur? When you walk or when you are swinging your hands or swinging a chain or something like that, the motion of the object, there's a slight blur that's happening which gives that fluidity of motion. Otherwise, it'll, everything will look very static. For getting that illusion of motion, you have to have motion blur. And when you set the shutter angle to 180, which is equal to 1 by 48 of a second in a DSLR term, you get the optimal motion blur. I'll show you a small video which will demonstrate this concept. We are on FCP now. In the interface, we have loaded three clips. Each clip is recorded in a different shutter angle. The first clip is recorded in the shutter angle of 180, which is the normal speed. Look at the motion of the clip, especially the swinging of the punchak. You can see there's a lot of motion blur in it. This is the normal motion blur behavior. Now, the next clip the shutter angle is 90. The chain is much more distinct. This is very good for action sequences. Now the third shutter angle is 45. It is much more clearer and crisper. So this is especially useful when you want to extract 8 megapixel stills from a GH4 4K video. So to do that, I select the frame which I want to export. I just take the correct emotion, go to the share button and say TIFF file, you know, export a TIFF file. So it goes and say setting is a TIFF file, uh, go to next, it will ask me where to put it. I have a folder ready here, it is called photos for 4K video. I will just save the file. You can see the sharing happening. So it is just transferring the file and I can see the file just here. Look at the quality of the still, you know like. So this is the effect you can do with shutter angles. So the greatest advantage of the GH4 is we are able to extract 8 megapixel still images from this camera. There is no motion blur because we are setting the shutter angle to 45 degrees and it's all very crisp. So if you're going to be shooting dance and action and sports, if you're going to keep this kind of a shutter angle and shoot, you can freeze any frames and get a decent eight megapixel image, which is good enough to do a A3 size print. A very useful feature to use even in weddings and stuff like that. So you could, uh, be shooting both video and still at the same time. Thank you for watching. This is Selva Kumar signing off for Audio Media Channel.